What's up, everybody? Zach here with the Nerd Cave. It is Tuesday, April 9th, 2024. The year is already flying by, everybody. We're already in April, which is kind of crazy. Four months into the year, it felt like we just started the year, but now we're four months into this year. Uh, but it's going great. I hope everyone is having a fantastic evening sarah amy welcome to the stream Don't let me know how you are dan welcome 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 how was everyone's weekend y'all let me know down in the chat put out a new car thoughts video i think i'm gonna call it car thoughts i have no idea i have no idea uh but put a new one out today talking about uh several different things so y'all go check it out Hello probably we'll talk a little bit about that tonight as well Hello. but having a fantastic time Hello. because tonight we're gonna be playing some princess peach showtime see how far we can get into that i've been enjoying the game so it's gonna be fantastic we've got uh we got the thief we've got a lot of cool stuff um <laughs> yeah we're not playing helldivers 2 tonight but we might jump back in since there are some crazy things going on in helldivers uh so if we get a crew together i'm down for some helldivers possibly next week um and doing all that cool stuff welcome Marilyn. hope you're doing well guys we got an awesome week planned for y'all i am excited got princess peach tonight tomorrow we've got nerd cave news at 7 p.m central time and me and derek are going to be diving into it we got some cool stuff today from star wars outlaws we got a date we got a new trailer i'm super stoked for that so we're going to be diving into that and all the cool stuff that is happening tomorrow so it's gonna be fantastic sarah says i can't find this game in walmart or target must be good it's really fun um it's pretty simple um gameplay wise and everything i got it digitally that's how i pretty much get all my games at this point because i don't want to <laughs> i don't want to deal with like not finding it and people so <laughs> and it's just easier for me to like just do uh digital and everything so uh but yes we're gonna be playing that tonight it's gonna be fun i'm looking forward to seeing what the thief is about um and then we've got two more doors on the second floor we got a boss battle and then we got the basement which i'm very very curious to see what it is all about down there if uh we get a lot of cool things and uh see how we wrap up the game i don't think we'll finish it tonight but um yeah i don't know sarah says i played the demo at target i don't buy digitally if i can avoid it i understand especially with a lot of the issues with digital like when they like take things off of the store and everything totally understand i went digital gosh it's been since ps4 i was i've been digital uh pretty much the whole entire time um if i could help it uh, there's times i had you know disc and everything but yeah i really enjoy digital just because of like being able to just boom it's there it does stink with the the updates and everything but a lot of the industry is moving more and more towards um having everything digital like um star wars outlaws you have to have an online connection when you first get the game even if you have the physical version which is kind of stupid so i don't know i don't know maybe i maybe i'm one of the people that are the problem that was a hassle today pulled out my cds and the ps5 won't play them so i did not i had an odyssey to find a portable cd player today yeah playstation 5 is weird um because i tried to play a cd on it on mine for like a year or so ago for something i was doing and i was like what is this why won't it play a basic cd when it can read blu-rays and all of that it was i was like this is stupid this is stupid that it won't play a, a basic cd and everything so totally totally feel you on that 100 percent 
guys let me know how your weekend was down in the chat had a good one uh, got to kind of veg on sunday um had a good saturday got some books did all of that i um had a good had a good weekend y'all um so hope yours was good as well dived into some of assassin's quest which is going fantastic robin hobb just absolutely crafting an amazing story so we're working our way through that we're all tit we've just finished the 10th chapter in that um enjoying it i've been reading the last graduate by naomi huh novik naomi novik uh and been enjoying it so i um i won't spoil anything but if y'all are looking for some dark academia um magic school that's not necessarily harry potter um it's really good i'm apparently not a hob fan royal assassin killed me royal assassin there was definitely times where i was like what are you doing fitz what are you doing uh but the twist and turns like did you sarah did you finish royal assassin that's my my question i don't want to run anything because i know dan is working his way through uh some of these books too you dnf'd it okay yeah um there were times not that i wanted to dnf it it there was times where i was just like i want to just slap you slap this boy um <laughs> but the the twists and turns by the end of the like throughout the whole book but the end of the book was so so good um so that's all i can say i i really enjoyed it amy really enjoyed it as well uh so i we're really enjoying the farseer trilogy you got 30 percent through okay let me think on that it's not as slow as assassin's apprentice but i think um it does it, yeah fitz definitely goes through a lot of things some annoying i will say and it's just like he's a teenage boy you know but that um it, it's got some good stuff i i'm not even i'm not even joking it's got some really good stuff um at the end there dan says i'm able to use my itunes on my playstation 5 okay i didn't know you could do itunes i i like my issue was like trying to play just an actual cd which was um really stupid that i wasn't able to do that so but yeah working through the last graduate i'm enjoying it enjoying assassins i mean um assassin's quest almost said assassin's apprentice um really really digging those books um i think after i finish the last graduate i'm gonna finish the third book of this like trilogy um i'm not even sure what the trilogy is called scholar Mance trilogy i have no idea um but i'm really enjoying those Sarah said, I'm enjoying Brandon Sanderson's Cosmere. I want to get into the Cosmere. It's not, it's not anywhere near the top of my list right now, just because I know it is, uh, it's a bit of a, um, time sink. Um, cause we're, I, I'm really enjoying Robin Hobb stuff. So that is definitely like on the top priority. Cause Amy and I are reading it together. Um, Amy reads to me um and it's it's great uh because i just get to sit there and listen uh to her read um there's one that i heard about we were watching i want to say peru's um peru's project reagan it's called empire of silence um and this is the um the synopsis Hatteran Marlowe, a man revered as a hero and despised as a murderer, chronicles his tale in the galaxy-spanning debut of the Sun Eater series. Merging the best of space opera and epic fantasy, it was not his war. 
on the wrong planet at the right time for the best reasons hatter and marlowe started down a path that could only end in fire the galaxy remembers him as a hero the man who burned every last alien from the sky they remember him as a monster the devil who destroyed his son casually annihilating four billion human lives even the emperor himself against imperial orders but hatterin was not a hero he was not a monster he was not even a soldier fleeing his father and a future as a torturer Her Her Hatterin finds himself stranded on a strange backwater world, forced to fight as a gladiator and navigate the intrigues of a foreign planetary court. He will find himself fighting a war he did not start for an empire he does not love against an enemy he will never understand. You got to make a reading tab so I can stop taking your general section with my reviews on Discord. I yeah, I need to tell murdoch ask murdoch to get that taken care of yeah it it does sound good i i'm by the way if y'all are interested in audiobooks right now audible is doing a 99 cents this is not an ad um for us at least uh they're doing like a 99 cents promotion right now where you can get three months for 99 cents you should totally do it it's really really cheap i of course we're using libby for a ton of stuff but there are times where i will buy books so i'm going to finish this um scholar Mance trilogy and then i'm probably going to jump back into thrawn um i just needed a break i i, I enjoyed the first one the second one wasn't hitting right away so i'm going to jump back into it and see after i finish this trilogy but we'll we'll see we'll see what's up brandon how's it going amy says reading ray bearer book lovers and the girl from the other side and also assassin's quest with me um yeah amy's been telling me about ray bearer it sounds interesting um it's got some really unique like plot stuff and their political system sounds very very intriguing um so i might jump into that someday i don't know when but uh we'll see um <laughs> got the baby and she's watching you oh gotta raise them right gotta raise them right with some nerd cave you know what i mean uh so today guys i i gotta i gotta share a little bit of an embarrassing story <laughs> a little bit of an embarrassing story <laughs> so i'm sitting at work and <laughs> i'm i'm working and my stomach is a little a little rumbly and i'm like okay once i get to this place you know a place where i can stop i'll go and use the bathroom so i'm editing and i can feel a sneeze coming on and i'm like okay guys i sneeze so hard that i fart <laughs> at work like there's people all around me too and i'm like like i hope that my sneeze was loud because it was a pretty loud sneeze i'm like i have headphones on and everything so i couldn't really like gauge how large how loud the fart compared to the sneeze was but like i sat there for a second and i was like looking and like a few people had headphones on and everything and i was just like so i got up and i literally just started texting amy i was like <laughs> so i sneezed so hard i farted and <laughs> i'm just like oh my god nobody said anything but i'm pretty sure the guys that sit on the other side of the cubicle of me totally totally caught it like i couldn't gauge like how loud the fart was brandon but i it wasn't like a little little boop, you know it, it was there there was some there was some pressure there was a little bit of air there you know what i mean <laughs> so uh yeah um i gave everybody a little bit of a little bit of a, a toot today you know so uh <laughs> I, 
put a five in the chat if you've ever done that because uh i was not expecting to uh let her rip tater chip i did yes snarted snarted yep toot toot <laughs> it was enough to clap a bit no it i wouldn't say it was like a like a like that it was like a it was like that sort of deal oh but it was like in like there was enough pressure where my body was like all right we got it we're, we got to relieve the pressure on both ends here so yeah <laughs> nobody said anything a loud puff yeah i would say it's more that <laughs> sarah's like i've done worse all right all right now at home is a totally different story you know what i mean but at work that that was definitely the uh the first one for sure for the the first one for sure i've never had that issue um before so uh, <laughs> dan i've farted plenty I fart plenty, but I'm not sure I've ever farted because of a sneeze. Well, it was like my stomach was already rumbling and like I was already kind of, kind of, y'all want to know, I was already kind of a little bit gassy, you know what I mean? Kind of a little bit gassy. And I was like, all right, I'm on get to a stopping point editing. Cause like guys, I was like in focus mode today. I was just bang and It, it just the sneeze was so forceful that it just it was like Ugh, like one of those like, and then it just both ends just pop pa but they were at the same time you know what i mean so yeah i definitely saved them for for amy when when, when i want to get home oh oh that's no bueno, Sarah. That's no bueno. <laughs> Dan, I think I've discovered why teachers leave the classroom so often. It's because they need to fart and have to leave the classroom to make sure none of the students hear. <laughs> See, that <laughs> that's the nice thing about band because the band is playing. You wait until it gets loud and you just just let it go it's a little burp, you know what i mean that's a little little secret there <laughs> i also sneezed so hard last year i threw out my back wow wow sounds like sneezing is a dangerous sport for you sarah <laughs> sounds like it was a dangerous sport for me Yeah, the stomach problems here tonight. Everybody's everybody's putting them out on front street. That's all right. We're here together in solidarity, guys. In solidarity. But yeah, I I felt like I needed to to humanize myself a little bit today, so I I uh, you know shared shared uh, shared that with y'all tonight. <laughs> oh man, so it hurt for two weeks in boot camp i throw out my back over a cold from all the coughing Ugh. now i understand the coughing like coughing so much that your body just starts like racking in pain that is never fun that is never fun and i could totally understand your bunk mates hating you uh 100 <laughs> um I think like my if I had done that uh people would have hated me I, I know like when I was in band in college we would travel we would travel on the bus at night uh to save money on hotels which was great and fun uh but my snoring would sound like a uh a bear with like chainsaws for hands so um and i know amy put up that with that for years 
<laughs> with me just like snoring up a storm thankfully uh the cpap has definitely helped that uh, because um now i actually get some rest you know that which is nice i get some rest the cpap machine has been a blessing 100 percent air force boot camp and i had to go to to med hold and military hospital sucks Ugh. yeah that's no bueno that's no bueno mm -mm. guys i've almost decided i've almost decided you can't see the studio right now but it's gotten to the point where i might actually clean it <laughs> like there's just so much junk i feel like i'm like my creativity is being stifled if that makes sense like i don't mind like having like i can find pretty much anything that i need but it just feels like there's just you know i'm i'm not like the you know cluttered desk is a cluttered mind type deal you know goes with that uh well it's like what is the opposite a clean desk is an empty mind empty mind i don't know but um yeah i'm i'm at the point where i'm like i need to i need to take take a few hours and clean because um i feel like it's clutter just moves to different corners yeah that's where i'm at right now but i've got like boxes and just junk that doesn't need to be in here and it's like i just need to take a few hours clean it get everything put away because like my studio at work everything's in this place everything's in this place because i also have somebody that tells me that i have to go clean it up when i don't um so i i avoid anastasia telling me to go <laughs> clean up the studio can't clutter much in an rv true true what's up nate how's it going hope you're doing well man but yeah that's that's where i'm at right now because like this shot guys this shot is perfect because y'all can't ever tell that it's dirty you can't tell it's like oh look at all those books look at those books that's a nice bookshelf back there but in front of me is just junk so i got i gotta i gotta put you know put some elbow grease into it i need to put away some bins that have our all of our uh, christmas stuff in there so yeah you know it is it's well just going through some old magic cards to sell noise noise hopefully uh you get some moolah from it how do you categorize your books so that is one thing that amy and i need to go through because right now our books are just kind of on the shelf um how i used to categorize my books because we didn't have enough bookshelves <laughs> to do it um but when i was in college before this got kind of crazy um i used to do chronological through the because majority of my books are star wars books if y'all don't know that um so i would go chronologically through the timeline of star wars so that is my hope is to chronologically go through the star wars books and everything um which kind of will get kind of messy because not all of them are hardback um but we are adding we're continually adding more books so it's i feel like we need more bookshelves to be honest um at this point just to be able to because i've got we've got literally stacks on some of the star wars books where it's like one stack and then another stack like inside the bookshelf so um like for star wars like anything that has like a chronological order through a series that's how i like to categorize it and then from there if it's not in a series then by author and then by like alphabet um and probably like the series that we like more will be like higher up type deal so things that we don't like lower you know you know what i mean things that got cool covers 
that sort of deal so yeah we need more shelves for sure oh yeah you can clutter a space no matter like no matter no matter how big or small it is uh, I can't wait to have my library slash garden shed make my bookshelves. I never had a space like that. That is, that would be super dope. That will be super dope. That is one of my like things that I want is like a, just a library room um, where there are like places to read in like cozy little corners and then having like shelves and like the, the sliding like uh, ladder thing I think would be super cool you know one of these days one of these days that's that's gonna happen so but yeah um we need to we need to categorize and I, I've got like doubles of things so I feel like I need to pull the doubles out get the best like qu condition Hello. copies of the books that I have on there Hello. and then uh figure out like we bought like 25 books this past weekend <laughs> on top of the books that i bought amy for her birthday uh so we we just continually are adding more and more we do do a lot of library stuff which definitely uh helps because it's like once we find a book that we enjoy then yes we'll buy it uh to put on our shelves and everything so yes the books were a dollar a piece those 25 books so um don't think we like drop some mad cash uh it may also be where we do our homeschooling and where i make my youtube video again oh there we go that's what i'm talking about that's what i'm talking about now nate do you have a blue eyes white dragon do you, do you have one of those one of those uh do you have the the zodiac killer card you let me know you let me know if you got those <laughs> everybody's like what is he talking about i'm i'm totally uh messing messing right now because that's Yu -Gi -Oh, my brother i know that Yu -Gi -Oh, I know i know that that's the blue eyes white dragon the zodiac killer is a a serial killer <laughs> so I, I don't think you've got any of those instead of throwing away books should i mail them to you um possibly like it really depends on like what books they are like i wouldn't be opposed to just like getting a ton of books um you can take a picture of the, your shelf or whatever but yeah I'd be down. I'd be down to to get some some books, some books. The full bullpen. Next time I clean out, I'll check with you. Okay, sounds good, ma'am. Yeah, like no Tom Clancy, no Patty uh, Patty J. James Patterson. We don't mess with that. Nora Roberts, um, W E B, um, whatever his name is like any of those, like any, any of like the kind of like old man war books. We're not about no Danielle Steele, uh, no Dean Koontz, no Louis Lamore, none of that junk. We, we, we don't do that tonight was final girls and some disney books with a tiger and a sword what i'm very confused <laughs> there goes half the collections yeah i we just i i just don't read any of those I, amy doesn't read them like so it would be just i'm not dissing lou in the more i just don't want them yeah okay i got you like what we would probably do is if you sent everything we'd pick through whatever we wanted and then donate the others to the libraries around here or uh, do like put them in little libraries that are around uh the area so that's that's probably what we would do with anything we wouldn't want now the leather bound louis lamore i've never read a louis lamore 
but the leather bound ones are cool i will say that i will say that 100 percent. but yeah I, i'm not i'm not a i'm not a cowboy book kind of guy um there used to be like a dog book growing up that was like cowboys oh dope yes it is national library week thank you love go support your local library go check out a book go get a library card all of that good stuff it helps support your local library uh because <clears throat> how it usually works is majority of them it's based on like how many books they check out how many cards they have how many active memberships and all of that and then that's how they allocate money to the libraries and everything so go support your local library and what's cool is you can actually i'm going all down into the the book stuff uh right now but you can use this uh thing called libby if you haven't seen it before um you can get different books by the way love the seven year slip is available tomorrow uh, but you can get audiobooks which is what i normally do and then you can also get kindle books on here as well and you can also use a thing called hoopla um so go support your local libraries uh and don't waste a ton of money that's what we've kind of uh decided on it's like hey we can um save money by using our local library all that good stuff so this week guys we have tonight's stream of course which we're fixing to jump into uh some of the game and then tomorrow night we have nerd cave news at 7 p.m central time if you haven't already go check out eat sleep anime put a five in chat if you watched it i want to know what your thoughts are what are some things we should talk about for the next episode we're going to do one in june but i'm curious to see what y'all think about it and let me know what would y'all want me to discuss on car thoughts murdoch says i know when the library puts on a sale it's slam packed 100 100 we are one of the people that goes to the library sales so you too can save 50 or more by switching to your library yes they sometimes do have tech a lot of this stuff is like outdated one of the cool things i want to try is the at the one of the big local libraries here they have a three like a few 3d printers i'd like to go and like print some things uh because i've got got some things that i would like to get printed um to be able to build out and everything yes i have i have several i don't have all seven i would i'm curious to see which one um oh that is cool i've heard about the wi-fi hotspots. you can also check out movies like movies tv shows um dvds and blu-rays and all of that and they've got manga um yeah yeah so they've, they've got a ton of stuff um and you can look up a lot of their services and all of that what they offer you can also um get room like a room for like study groups or like meetings you just have to sign up for it so libraries are awesome y'all go support them and go watch eat sleep anime because it's awesome and we put a ton of work into it and i think the intro is super dope because it's super dope and all that good stuff so yeah 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 all right guys it is time i'm ready to get into some princess peach showtime so let's do this um derek is definitely more of the uh person to talk about um the seasonal stuff the thing that i'm waiting on is my hero and demon slayer um 
season three of I was re I reincarnated as a slime is coming out as well. That one I'm about to start. I'm in jo um, Jujutsu Kaisen season one. I just finished it. So, and I'm rewatching Yu Yu Hakusho right now because <laughs> why not? Why not? Peach time. Peach time. Let's look around. The sour thieves are worse. Boom, let's go. The mask, the dashing thief could stop. Why would a thief stop thieves? Just saying. Oh no, it's the sour thieves. What? They're stealing all the jewelries and the monies. Whoa, what is this strobing? Boom. Let's go. A good thief is a thief that steals from bad thieves. Yes. Oh, I see what you're doing. Okay. I don't know why I can't break them. Boom. Boom, son. Turned them off. Boom. Let's go. Yeah, I could definitely see that. Some Persona 5 vibes. Faux show. Whoa. You managed to slip past those guards, huh? With those kinds of skills, then perhaps. Follow me, will ya? Guys, I'm also wearing my uh, my cow dress. Did y'all notice that my my cow pattern? You got a good feeling about me. Yep, you should be the right right one for the job. You're gonna be a thief, a little old thief. Yeah. Welcome to our secret society. Ooh, ooh. What, what do I do? Boom, let's go. We're activating it. We're activating it. Oh. So is it a secret agent or a thief? Boom. Let's go. definitely like magic girl vibes every time this happens i just think of like sailor moon easy easy oh grappling hook dashing thief peach let's go guys oh oh You'll need to infiltrate the building. We'll be supporting you along the way. Okay, dope. Let's go, baby. Yes, Zoro. Oh. This is really cool, guys. I'm not even, not even joking. I'm loving it. I'm loving it. Let's go. No, don't die. 
want to go get these coins oh gosh how do i how do i get up there okay i don't think i can man these lasers are murdering me trying to murder me then antonio banderas went nah we're going old school with some zorro gotta go old school black and white tornado i used to love zorro okay i'm gonna just tell y'all press b in front of a lock to disable it Psh, we got this because we are the master thief the dashing thief whatever i love the holding on to the hat Yeah, I didn't think I was supposed to go on down to the bottom there. Let's go. Man, I'm getting massacred up in here. If you want a good anime about a thief, you can watch Kid the Phantom Thief. It's an anime that takes place in the universe of Detective Conan. It's about a kid who steals things in showy ways and uses illusionism to do so. Huh. That sounds pretty dope. Not even gonna lie. Don't know why I would lie, but you know. <laughs> Boom, baby. Oh, 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 oh. How do I get up there? I don't know how to get up there guys i want that star but i can't get up there so far the thief not necessarily my favorite oh there we go ah i see i see let's go i do like the pose i do like the pose a lot oh no oh Oof. Ouch. I'm dead. No, the first time I've ever died. Oh, well, it's only 10 coins. You know what I mean? Yeah, that does sound like a cool premise. Uh, we finished season two of of Spy Family. and really enjoyed it okay bro yes. boom i should have got the things though but i didn't unfortunately we got all the good y'all and the monies you did it you got all the jewels back and now it's time to make your escape Oh gosh. Boom. I do like the music. The music is jamming. The music is jamming. Oh. 
Oh, let's go. Don't know where I'm supposed to go, but am I running off this side? Apparently so. Oh no. I've got to oh my gosh. No. I want to play this one again and get all the stars, y'all. I'm over here like, no. Yes. He's okay. Yeah, I, I like my favorite one so far is the ninja. That is definitely my favorite one at the moment. I, I like, I think I've gotten all of them unlock though i don't i don't know if there's any secret ones that i haven't played kung fu i haven't played i think there's a rotisserie one so i don't know guys let me know what has been your favorite so far uh because thief was okay not my favorite though. the ice skater one was pretty cool too I'm trying to remember so it was ice skater and then the detective was all right all right we've got another swordsman ah, ah. the ghostly castle Ooh. Ooh. You're welcome. I'm giving you the sound effects. One of my absolute faves is Sherlock Hound, and I read they are thinking about re releasing them. I haven't heard of that before. Oh. So I start automatically with the castle is used to feel what people are wondering what's going on here. Oh. Okay. Oh no, oh no, it's a ghost, it's a ghost. All trespassers in my castle shall fall. Ah, sword fighter, please, you've got to help us. Boom, son. I didn't need a heart. Flawless. Boom. He didn't, he didn't stand a chance. Boom. Let's go, baby. I do like the little secret rooms that are in in the levels. I thought there would be more to it sure. thought there would be more to it yeah i was wondering if you were talking about wishbone as well is it a manga or man why y'all hurting my friends is it the pox man your adventures in here No way, Jose. No way. 
what I say. No way, Jose. Boom. Coming to the corporal plane. How dare you? It's an anime. Old school. Okay, okay. Yeah, I've never heard of that. Nope. You again. Time to send you flying. How about I go down? There we go. Ooh, almost didn't make it. Almost didn't make it. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I was hoping to get that uh, treasure chest. Not lying. Come on now, son. Not being dumb this time. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. All right, this is timing. It's just timing. You ain't got nothing, boy. I don't ever stop moving. Can't stop, won't stop is what I say. Oh yeah, Lupin. I've always wanted to watch Lupin, but I've never have. Oh, the sword fighter. This would be easier if you just sit still. So I'll make you sit still. Are you sure about that? Okay. Maybe I, uh, Ooh, let's go. Let's go, son. You ain't got nothing. Uh oh, uh oh. So he's going to come through the wall. Oh, they like dropping things in this game. You know what I mean? They like, they like dropping the things. All right, you, you coming on out? What? Hogwash? Hogwash. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. What? Come on, man. I'm pressing the button. What more do you want? What more do you want? Get gone! Get out of here! Get out of here! You did it! Let's go, baby! That's what I'm talking about, guys. That's what I'm talking about. Let's give them something to talk about. Let's give them something to talk about. I haven't said that in a long time. Let's talk about love. Yeah. Put a five in the chat if y'all remember that. Y'all, y'all. Oh, I used to do that all the time. I used to do that all the time. I don't remember doing it recently. 
So I'm going to say that I haven't done it in a long time. Okay. Don't come at me. Let's go. It is a throwback. Thank you. Even though we didn't find the sword fighter Sparkula, the only place seems to be back to normal. Interesting. Now I'm the sword fighter. Whoa, that belonged to the sword fighter Sparkula. I've heard Sparkler Spirits is given to actors entrusted with the starring role. This is amazing, Peach. It means you've been recognized as a sword fighting sword fighter spirit. Let's go. Can anyone hear me? Sounds like it's coming from the basement. Let's go check there. Well, we got to beat the boss. What's with the cow spots on her dress? Uh, it's my outfit. Thanks, Dan. Over here making me feel like it's my outfit. It's the pattern. It's my look. So are these all the sparkulas or whatever? How strange. There wasn't anything like this in the basement before. No, there wasn't. We came and checked earlier. Oh, I bet we can see things we couldn't before because you've been entrusted with the sword fighter spirit. Anyone? We got to free him. We got to free him. Can anyone hear me? It's coming from there. All right, let's get in there. That's what Stella sounds like. A like very manly voice. <laughs> yeah, so they're different pattern outfits and everything. Um, we've got one that looks like the regular Princess Peach. It's a gradient one. There's one with flowers, which is the sword fighter one. Um, there's one, I think the ninja one is like a Sakura kind of thing. What's this? This stage is set so bizarre now. It's not like one of ours at all. I just made up that last part. Peach, let's be careful. Boy, you ain't got nothing. You ain't got nothing. Oh. Yeah, we're getting that star. So I already missed one star, apparently. Hmm, we gotta go find that. Let's go. Let's go! Ha! That's right. What, how, 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 son? Come on, dude. It's like the the dodge button not working. Cause it's like, yo, you hit the little dodge button, the little A jump, A button, you know? And it's like, oh, bang. I do like that it's all just a stage play though. That is a cool thing. All right, Sarah, so you have a great night. Go get us. Go get the sprint. Get that read on. Get that read on. Let's go. Feel like I'm in Game of Thrones with all these swords everywhere. Let's go. We got our badge. Okay. Okay. 
Someone, please. All right, we're, this is going to be our first full star run, y'all. It's the Sword Fighter Sparkler. Don't worry, we'll get you. That outfit. Who are you? And does that sell? Be careful. This place is. <laughs> oh, he's big boy. In the name of Matam Grape, I will defeat you. Mm. <laughs> Boom, son. Boom, son. I'm about to get a bunch of minions. Oh. Not today. Yeah, gone, boy. The great night. Yeah. <laughs> Amy would hate him because she hates great flavored things. You ain't got nothing, Grape Knight. Do you see that? You see that? You're gone to the abyss. Boom. All oh, the stars. <sighs> we saved it. Get him. Boom. We've got him. You're welcome. We've got to escape. Escape. Ack. There you go. There you go. It is a coward in the loop. Boom. Finish him. We did. We did indeed. Hmm. Like that. Thank you very much. Let's go. Let's go. You got a stellar ribbon. Let's go, guys. Stella ribbons abound. Now we got a companion. I don't know if it's going to be like we get like combo moves. Like, I don't know how that's going to work. What, what that's going to do for us. I don't know. That's pretty exciting, though. Taking care of taking care of business every day mm -hmm. who'd have thought they imprisoned the sparklers on their own stages i'm certain this means we can save the rest of the sparklers by restoring their plays thank you both for saving me they robbed me of my powers and trapped me those fiends now i will resume my role of protecting others allow me to express my gratitude once more thank you <laughs> Guys, I'm proud of us. Came through that. Well, let's head back to the second floor. We got to take out this boss. Got to take out this boss. Like, there's some some good things in the game. Like, I'm. I was saying in the car thoughts, I, if this game was like $40, it would be an amazing game. It being 60 definitely makes it a lot, a lot harder to like justify. Ooh, look at that. That's a pretty dope pattern. Mm, not about the disco dress. Yeah, I do like that. We're getting it. We're getting it. Yeah, let's go. Lovely. Guys, look at that. That is a dope dress. All right, we're backing out. We did get a new ribbon for Stella. 
though. Oh, that's not what I wanted. Uh, plus, there we go. I don't play enough Nintendo guys to know what's going on. Let's go. Yeah, so we get like different ones. I do like the ninja dress one. I can't wait to, cause this is like the regular sword fighter and then the special sword fighter one. Super look, super cool looking. All right, here we go. Second floor guys. We're about to unlock something. So there is a third floor at least. I don't know how many floors this thing's got. All right, here we go. Gotta give Stella some stars. All right, let's blast open this door with the power of Sparkle. Let's do it. Let's go. Blast it open, Stella. Kame, Hame. Ah! That's what I, I expect. That's what I expect. Hard to go Super Saiyan. Everything's Super Saiyan. You know what I mean? Everything's Super Saiyan. Guys, hope you're all doing well tonight. If you haven't already, smack the like button. We're playing some Princess Peach Showtime. We're taking on our second boss major boss oh well 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 if it isn't the scared little rodents who've been scurrying to and fro about my theater i think that's one so what do you think of my production have you been enjoying my terrifying show that's that's the voice huh Answer that later. A little bird told me that you two have been kicking up some dust. This is this is the voice. Huh. I also heard you managed to save a sparkler. I went to great pains to imprison. <laughs> Your efforts are adorable, but saving one puny sparkler doesn't change anything. Thing, entertain our best kick ass queer you. I'd like to review the performance. I'll take the Oscar now. I'll take the Oscar right now. Light thing. Now, is this the the snake that was uh, in Shakira's world tour? I feel like it is. <laughs> Boom. Elegance. <laughs> Boom. Snake, you ain't got nothing. dropping random you know what you know how it is it's it's random shakira effects time i don't know why it's glowing like this i have no idea boom son oh little gobble it gobble goody gooks Boom, son. Yay. Yay. That snake also cost her a million dollars to produce. 
and then uh, was so expensive to travel with that it actually uh, made her first world tour, which was her most uh, profitable one, actually cost her money. You know, just a little, little, little factoids here. Okay, it goes up, around, comes back down. Boom! Blinded by the light, revved up like a deuce. Another rover in the night, blinded by the light. Boom, son. Boom, son. Where you gonna go, son? Wow. Okay. Oh, boy. Oh. Very curious what it does, but I don't want to know at the same time. Okay, I'm just seeing the pattern. It goes around in the circle here. Gotcha, gotcha. All right, all right. Oh, nope. If you like the jazz, the jazz is cool. What if it was just like really dumb and it was like still down below? You know what I mean? Whoa, whoa, that is interesting. Boom, son. Oh, so that's like. Huh. Okay, now I know your secret, you demon spawn. I feel like. Okay. I have to go like when it's like actually like facing this. What? Oh my gosh. How? in the world Danny Phantom I only got like 10 coins I'm gonna be careful here Do I, am I starting all no okay I'm not all the way back okay he's trying to get me he does the loop de loop Okay, go down here. And we here, and then we little scooby to doop doop. You know what I mean? A little scooby to doop doop. Come on, I was so close. Oh, this boy, he be trifling me.
Come on, child. Okay, okay, okay. All right. No. All right. what happens that's what happens when you mess with peach she kicks your peach y'all get it y'all get it y'all know y'all know that was actually kind of difficult i'm over here like this game's like super easy and then it's like that was actually kind of challenging boom guys second floor we got it second floor opened up everybody let's go so grape is the one responsible for all the trouble in our beautiful theater she and her motley bunch are ruining our place girl i won't stand for this well you can't stand because you don't have any legs but anyway we can't allow them to do whatever they want to our beloved theater let's restore the rest of the plays as quickly as we can all right going up to the third floor is this the third and final i don't know i don't know how many floors there are we're about to see we're about to see guys Okay, so there are four floors at least. All right, we've got Chef Mermaid. Mermaid Cow. We got a cow. And then Kung Fu. For Amy, I'm going to go Mermaid. We're going to go Mermaid first. And then we'll do Kung Fu. And then Cow. Because that'll be like the second cow girl and the second pastry chef melody of the sea mermaid 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 murmur into my ear the answers the questions i'm longing to hear Stella, this play is everything mermaids and includes a very talented singer. Oh, there's a concert today. Let's go see the singer perform. Are the fish are jumping? What? This is cool. Let's go. Oh, it made the coconut bigger. What? Let's go. They almost look like, uh, like Yoshi eggs almost. Let's go. Uh-oh. Yeah, y'all get away from my friends. My mermaid friends. Slow and weak. Oh no, the turtle. I didn't even notice that. Wakey, wakey, turtle friend. You're welcome. He looks like um, a Happy Meal, like the the box of a a hamburger at McDonald's. Does that make sense? <laughs> I 
I'm glad glad I'm not the only one because it definitely looks like that. We still can't go in. Maybe something happened. Oh, I do like the band like the band outfits <laughs> with the plumes underwater. I don't know how they're gonna play. We can't hold the concert without the singer. Where could that sparkler be? Probably Kid Now. If I have if I have a guess, probably the old kidnapped. Boom, give me that dough. Give me that dough, give me that dough. Oh, could this be the singer's cove? I bet it is, guys. Can y'all believe it's the singer's cove? Because I definitely can. Let's go. It's mermaid time. I do like the new uh, ribbon for Stella. It makes it look interesting. Let's go, Mermaid Peach. So she's a siren. That's what you're telling me. Enchanting. Enchanting. Elegance. Elegance. Your voice. It's just like the singers. We had no luck finding the singer. We have, you have to join us on stage and perform. Well, we'll get there. Yeah, we'll, we'll get there in a second, bro. Let's go. I feel like I am. Mermaid magic girl. Yeah, 100%. I feel like I am Aquaman here, y'all. Thank you for everybody. The band is here now. We're ready to begin. Let's go. Yep. Uh oh. It's a giant crab monster thing. Uh, uh, uh. No. Nah. We're still going to perform. Well, apparently I gotta go save the band first. I'm, it's cool that it goes with it. Ariel, your voice got really deep, you, you know. You know. I've been working on my range. Been working on my range. Oh, help! Get me out! Oh, we got, we got a bunch of fish. Oh, we gotta, we gotta get even more fish. Oh, let's go. Mega fish powers. With our powers combined, we can free our band. You welcome. You welcome. Oh.
Okay. I see what you do. Ooh, I see a star. these fish guys um we gotta go back up though won't let me go back up so i can't go get the thing that i need foo foo on you you Our turtle. Let's go get some Mickey D's. <sighs> All right, let's get back to the video. Ooh. Okay, let's go, turtle. Turtle dove. It looks like I'm just floating above him. It's like, is he really carrying me there? Oh, everybody's scared. But we're about to brighten everybody's day. Yay! Yay! And let's go! Yeah, after that traumatic experience, we're going to give a concert. All right. While holding B, tilt towards the fish as they swim to you. Interesting. They're like notes. I just got it. Aha. Oh, I didn't. Sorry, I didn't get the rhythm right. It's like you don't explain it good enough. It's a pretty cool idea, though. Almost got all of them. Almost got all of them, guys. I would say that's pretty elegant. Yeah, I still think my favorite's the ninja. I want to play. Like, I'm curious how the kung fu one's going to be. Curious how the kung fu one's going to be. Guys. Let me know how you're doing down in the comments. Are you enjoying Princess Peach Showtime? It's been a lot of fun. It's a very easy game. There have been some challenges uh, with some of the boss fights, but overall, it's been really good. All right, Kung Fu, Mighty Mission, Alien Invasion. Showtime. 
it is a really fun game i agree guys we're fighting aliens as a kung fu master can y'all believe that it's pretty dope we're gonna punch some aliens in the face what up joe hope you're doing well started serving the lord's chicken today let's go how are you liking it man is it your pleasure they're being abducted we have to go hurry it's like you gotta like find like what the interactive part is of the map boom let's go but my arms are sore from holding the app hat all day so were you outside like doing the drive through and everything oh no they got lasers son ah nice yeah the weather's been really nice like the last few days for sure boom we're saving him and we get a bow let's go boom saved him too no biggie no biggie no biggie Oh gosh. Fire. Boom, son. We making it rain up in here. Boom, we haven't missed one yet. We made it, y'all. You're welcome. We got this. Oh, make sure you get these coins. Boom, baby. Ooh, ooh, ooh. The office block is on fire. We've got to help. We do. We got to help. Uh oh. Uh oh. Boom. I I know I am amazing. Now, Joe, with the the new job and everything, like, how much uh, free food you get? That's the real question. Let's put your skills to work, shall we? Now, I'm assuming this is the Kung Fu one. I'm assuming, I, unless there's like a superhero one that I miss. Get a free meal when I work. Okay. That's dope, man. Do you think you're going to get tired of Chick-fil-A? Because I had a lot of kids... Um, from when I was band director that worked at Chick-fil-A and some of them did get tired of it some of them loved it so I think it's just kind of like your uh your tolerance you know and your love of Chick-fil-A oh oh this is the futuristic one okay okay <coughs> yeah there is a lot to like <coughs> to eat at um at chick-fil-a so it's not just like chicken nuggets or a sandwich the salads are great i always get the spicy uh but i switch it with the um chicken nuggets because the spicy is spicy boom Oh, 
I need a hero. Yeah, I'll protect you. I need a hero to do the end of the nine. But, uh, yes, hero 101. Yes, 100%. Boom, son. You ain't got nothing. You're welcome. Oh, whoa, oh, whoa. Oh. Let's go. Is there another one over here? Super. Super. I'm trying to re retrain my go to yup and your welcome response to thank you. Do you mean. Yeah, going to uh, it's, you know, my pleasure, that sort of deal. Yeah, that one's a, a little bit hard one, but once you do it, you're never going to get back. Heroes are so powerful. They can lift the heaviest of objects. Yep. boom just throwing cars into the audience that's what we're doing guys yeah you have to say the co-workers as well yeah oh no let's go y'all protected Y'all protected. Boom, son. I think there's something back here that I can do, though. Yeah. Felt it in my fingers, down in my toes. Let's go. Whoa, 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 whoa. That's what I'm talking about. Super. That's what I'm talking about. Is that Peach's Hulk Buster suit? Essentially her like Iron Man suit for sure. With like some electromagnetic acquiring specimens acquiring specimens specimen acquisition is in inevitable It is inevitable. Resistance is futile. Yeah. You're not bothering me, little dudes. I'm here to protect you. My name is Mighty Glove or whatever my name is in this universe. This is my voice. Um, all oh, the hearts, yeah, big coins. Oh, they're gonna try to take this whole thing. I can feel it. Help! Uh oh. Sorry, I'm late. Times like this call from my special invention. Hop on the lift. Is it a mech suit? Tell me I'm about to pilot a Gundam. Okay, jetpack, that works too. Do you remember the show Totally Spies? Yes. Yeah. 
It does remind me of Totally Spies for sure. Oh no. Ah, I almost had all the bits so I could. Boom. Yeah, Gundam would have been like way cooler. Faux show. Well, I'm gonna die, y'all. Okay. Watch your opponent's movement closely when the timing is right. Counter with B. Well, I'm dead. Yeah, Gunnaman would, would have been like, oh, we're gonna. Maybe I'll get the extra star. I don't know where it's gonna start me. It might start me right at the boss fight. I don't know. Yeah, the game does not. It's not optimized super great. I will say that. Boom, son. But that is pretty dope. Yeah. Boom, son. That's all it took. That's all it took. Just one look. That's all it took. <laughs> Yeah, it does give me some totally spies. Faux show. Did I like? Okay, I thought I got the. Oh, that's kind of cool. All right, to be continued. Yeah, I'm enjoying the game. It's it's fun. Like it's. <laughs> I'm curious, like once it gets to, there are no new outfits. Like, I like that they've like, okay, each floor, it's like you get a mix of too new, too old. So it's like, okay, I'm not getting uh, like all just old outfits and everything. So I think they keeps it interesting. I'm, I think there might be five floors plus the basement just because it's like you've you introduce i think there's two more outfits after this which is the kung fu and the um there's supposed to be like a rotisserie i don't know i don't know if that's there's at least one oh i forgot she's got like horns on her hat because she's a cow girl what's going on Oh, yeah. They literally drove a train right through the middle of a city, y'all. Our homes, yeah. Hey. Penelope, our horse, everyone. Penelope, the horse. Let's go, Penelope. Oh. Let's go. Boom. Ooh. Oh no, oh no, ooh, ooh, that was close. Let's go, baby! The ramps up ahead 
use it to jump i am i'm gonna use it to jump on the train let's go yeah how yeah 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 how uh oh Must be something we can do. Cowgirls here. We're gonna crash into the next town. You've got to stop the train somehow. Hurry. Shh, we got this. After we go to this secret room that's somehow on the train. And everybody claps. You're welcome. Well, we. Now let's go save this town. Yeehaw. Let's go, Ribbon. Oh. That would have been bad. Oh. You're not getting mad. So that will hurt me too. Just, uh, putting that out there. Oh no, oh no. That's all I really cared about was the star. Not even gonna lie was getting the star not necessarily taking them out oh. is this like thing like a low rider now Whew. yeah i definitely need the heart right now more than anything you don't know what to give up, do you? In that case, bang. Penelope. <laughs> Penelope's like right on time, y'all. Huh? That's right. Penelope knows how to do it, y'all. Yahoo! Yahoo! <laughs> Another town to blast apart. It's like, what are you getting out of this? You know what I mean? Whoa. Boom, son. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Woody's roundup, yeah. I need a heart. Like real bad. I've only got one heart left. Boom. Peach is really strong, guys. I'm just gonna let y'all know that. Even without the magic gloves from the other place. Peach, she's a beast. <laughs> yeah, one hundred percent. Well, shucks. This is like Jesse. Boom! All the stars. Let's go. And the ribbon. Tie a yellow ribbon around the old oak tree. Makes me wonder why she needs to be rescued so often. I don't know. Maybe, maybe she actually doesn't like Mario, but he can't let her go. I don't know.
I don't know, guys. Boom. Does that mean we can go to the basement and now free? Yeah. Yeah, we could go do that or we can go over here. Welcome to the spooky party. Welcome to the spooky party. Spooky dookie. Gonna take a spooky dookie. <laughs> you yeah, know, it's what everybody does. Where it's like, oh my God, where did that come from? That's a spooky dookie, y'all. Just saying. Oh, pastries, pastry chef person. I can't do anything. Oh, what's happening over here? Let's go, let's go. Oh no. I've been sweet, delicious, and dubious just for you. Oh gosh. They're gonna get mind controlled. Ooh. Must eat sweets. They're like zombies, y'all. Okay. So this one's like, you pretty much just bake stuff. Uh oh. Sweets. Eat sweets. Your infections make everyone so happy. Maybe eating them will turn them back to normal. Let's do it. Let's make some gluten dairy free cakes, baby. Let's go. Cool. Dollop. 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 And boom. Perfect. That's what I am. Perfect, y'all. Oh, they'll like break down the barriers. Interesting. Okay. Dollop, 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 dollop. Gorgeous. That's what we're about here, making beautiful cakes. Boom. With it not spinning, it makes it a lot easier. I'm just going to tell you all that because the last one was like spinning while I did it. And it was way more difficult to make like different things. All right. Oh, it's like the, the star that we see. Perfect. Let's go. It's what we do here, y'all. Everybody's back to normal. Two stars. Let's go. Where's my second star? There we go. You better give that second star. Because I am fantastic. Let's go. Mm. Tasty. Tasty. Yeah, I feel like something's in Oh, okay. We're we're baking here. Boom. Don't know why I'm carrying around those, but we did it. Okay, so we got a... 
Dude, get on, get on over here. You don't know how to. You don't know how to cook. Boom. You got some Halloween cookies. Yeah, y'all, y'all eat some good cookies. Y'all eat some good cookies. Boom. Let's go. Let's give these little monsters some cookies. That's what I'm talking about, y'all. That's what I'm talking about. Wait. Okay. Well, let me let me get going, y'all. Let me get going. All right. All right. We got this. We got this. Okay. If you. Ooh, come on, come on, come on. Ho, ho, ho. Let's go. Ah, stink. Ah, oh, no, 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 no. I failed. Because it doesn't matter how many I make, actually, to be honest. I can make like Dang it. Come on, come on, come on, come on. what I'm talking about y'all three flipping stars baby a lego you're welcome <laughs> sorry for the sweet seeking rampage I'm down for a party. Ain't no party. Like a sweets party. Because a sweets party never gonna stop. Yeah, because I got a gold bowl. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Boom. Everybody gets a cookie. Everybody's happy. Sweet success. Sweet success, guys. <laughs> Delicious. So I'm, I missed one star on that one. Sad day, y'all. But I got it. Uh, we got a Stella ribbon. Estella, also the star in um, Spy Family that Anya gets at school. Estella, interesting, interesting. Guys, hope you're all having fun tonight. We're playing some Princess.
peach showtime we just finished the second pastry chef and i think we're about to be able to take on our next boss let's go yep stella like stellar yep 100 percent makes sense once you think about it i didn't put two and two together until now either all right let's take on this bad boy or girl it's a modern age of crime all right let's blast open this door with the power of sparkle can we give yeah i, can, I got sparkle gems out the wazoo 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 It's time for the final flash, y'all. Huh? Let's go. <laughs> Boom. Huh? It's like Stella is like so like amped up. It's like, why can't we just like keep filling her, you know, like giving her more of those uh sparkle gem things or whatever and her just be like pumped up the whole time you know what i mean oh ooh, that's a like a cheshire cat may not like it Meow. I'm you, the Peach and Stella I've heard about. <clears throat> Meow. I barely bit parts in Madame Grape's esteem production. Try as much as you like. You won't succeed. I'm coming up with these voices on the spot, guys. I suppose Mew think you can defeat someone as grand as me, the guardian of this dark door. It is very creepy. I'll swipe those smug expressions right off your little faces with my claws and then your face will be gone. Projector cat. Okay. Oh, yeah, you done messed up, AA Ron. You done messed up, AA Ron. Nothing. 
You raggedy boy. You raggedy. Oh, did he steal it? Oh, man. Okay, so I got to be careful of that so he doesn't steal it. I'm just trying to stay alive at this point. Just so uh we're almost at the end. We're we like if we can just get him to uh do the Yep, here we go. Here we go. We got him. Oh got him. Boom, son. Boom! Ya gone, creepy cat! Ya gone! Ya gone! Boom! Boom! Stella's for days! Stella's for days! Boom! Boom! Another one. Another one. Boom. Yeah. Let's go. <laughs> well, that enemy was something else, huh? At least this floor is back to normal, too. You've performed in lots of different plays now, so I'm sure we'll be fine no matter what comes our way. Uh-oh. Oh. Uh, what's that? DJ Cal, yes. <laughs> what is this? What is this? Mm -hmm. That's the theater star lift. I wonder if the threads and then then that door were somehow keeping it from working. Oh, maybe it's accessible again because we've weakened Grape's magic by restoring the lower floors. Now we can go to the basement and the other floors more quickly. You want to try it out? Mm -hmm. Sure, why not? why not okay so there is a fourth floor so there's five floors all in in total yeah because like having to go like by each floor would get uh get a little annoying so we've got ninja we got master thief we've got one kung fu is there a fifth floor there is a fifth floor y'all okay i want to try kung fu Cause we haven't done this one. We haven't done Kung Fu, but they brought back my favorite, which is Ninja. A Kung Fu tale. A Kung Fu tale. A Kung Fu tale. I'm just saying it over and over guys. Cause I'm excited. Still my favorite is, is the Ninja one. It's so good. It's peach time. Oh. Aku, what's going on? Something strange has happened. I love that he's like stroking the mustache. Uh oh. Long ago, in a distant land, teacher. Ha! All bark, no bite. I 
have failed. The master know what to do. We're giving y'all powers and strength. Yes, let's go. We're going. I'm just trying to find like the interactable things. You gotta, you gotta double tap them sometimes. Come on guys, use your strength. Go plus ultra. There we go. The United States. United States of Smash. Ooh. Ooh. Oh no. You're not getting through here. Kung Fu Master Trial? We got this. We got this. See, we're just passing it all. We're passing it all right now. Boom. We got this. Ain't no thing but a chicken wing. Let's go. It's Kung Fu time. Give me that power up. Give me that power up. Let's go. We be throwing rights. We be throwing lefts. We kicking, kicking ya in the face. Kicking ya in the face. Let's go. Boom, Kung Fu Peach unlocked. Let's go. Oh. I like it. I like it. Okay, if you would let me jump down. I like it. I already like it, y'all. Boom. Now, can I jump down here? Oh, that hurts me. Never mind. Don't jump down now. Just letting y'all know. We're gonna knock this door off its hinges. We're gonna kick these rocks into submission. Wah! Let's go. I could literally go kick them like two times and they'd all be dead, but you know, that's okay. Let's go. I've trade with the turtle hermit. You think yourself skilled, do you? I suppose I'll toy with you for a bit. All right, it's a one-on-one -on -one fight against a powerful foe. Press B at the right time to kick. Boom! Let's go. Mm, you're better than I thought. We'll fight again if you reach the training hall. 
Boom. Let's go. I'm enjoying, like, again, I, I still think the ninja is my favorite, but this is fun too. Up. Let's go. Oh, that was super cool. Being able to kick the yeah that's cool being able to kick that is like a kung fu movie 100 percent that is super dope oh no oh no i can't i can't go get that star over there because i knocked the building down no maybe if i reset this I feel like she can jump higher now, maybe. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah, the Kung Fu's fun, y'all. Okay. So I can't reset this, unfortunately. So I'm going to be missing one. which stinks but it is what it is yep i took them out with style it's what i do Oh no. Boom. Let's go, baby. Super cool. Spinning around like that. Pretty dope. keep getting pots <laughs> yeah boy Okay, your tail ends here. Oh, okay, well, we're doing that, huh? Boom! Let's go. glad we're getting some help because uh i need it yeah i missed a few of these unfortunately uh, i feel like i'm I feel like I'm going the way that it wants me to go, but I need to, there's like, yeah. Boom, let's go. I'm glad I went back. Almost missed that gentleman.
Boom, son. You ain't got nothing. You ain't got nothing. Ah. Teacher, hang in there. We're coming to rescue you right now. Sifu. Ooh, thank you for the heart. Because I needed it. Okay. We got this. You just stay on offense, they can't ever hit you. You know what I mean? Yeah, having the, the poles definitely make it a lot easier. Boom, son. Boom. Ain't no thing but a chicken wing. Ugh. Your technique is much like a kung fu master's. Our foe is through here. Please save the hall. Oh, we're going to. Boom. Let's go. Open it up. Let's go. Let's go. So here you are. I'm ready. Very well. Give it your best shot. Boom, son. Not bad. Let's see how you deal with this. Oh, that's so cool. With like the... With the jumps and all of that, like Crouching Tiger, Hidden Dragon, like a Kung Fu movie. Oh! Boom! Let's go, baby! All right, that was a lot of fun. It's like... I know I think it, it's also like appealing to like more of like the things that I I care for and everything but that was fun I like it's definitely ninja than kung fu uh the mighty fist or whatever it is was pretty dope Ooh, we can get clouds like the Akatsuki mm. Mm. That's gonna be pretty cool. Not gonna learn. Not gonna learn. We'll uh, apply that right after we load in. See how it looks. Our new outfit. Boom. Now, there's clearly one more floor. So let's um let's go to our wardrobe. Guys, we're part of the Akatsuki now. Yay. Peach is really excited. We're part of the Akatsuki. Confirmed. Look at those clouds. Only one group wears clouds like that. The Akatsuki. Just saying. Just saying. Just saying, y'all. Peach is part of the COD scheme. So now we've got unlocked the pastry. How dare you corrupt Peach like that? <laughs> so we've got the cowboy and we've got the um, pastry chef, I want to say are unlocked to do this so that's pretty dope all right we're gonna go to the first floor i think peach would fit in you know what i mean peach would fit in 
Zodkotsky. Maybe that's why they paint their, their fingernails and their toenails. I don't know. Up, up. Oh, I'm so pleased with my recent work. I've added more to your album. So take a gander. Oh, what we got? Oh, that's pretty dope. That's pretty dope, y'all. That's pretty cool. I wish they were a little bit higher res, but it's still pretty cool. The sword fighter is pretty dope, y'all. Cause you have to get like all the stars in a run for that. Um, yeah, Mighty Peach is okay. Mermaid Peach was all right. Uh, Kung Fu and Ninja are my favorite for sure figure skating peach was, was fine the cowboy peach cowgirl peach is pretty cool as well detective all right sword fighter is pretty good too we've got one more it looks like right we've got one more I'm curious what it is because it's two to unlock the um so that's the ninja and then that's the detective but it's like saying there's one more i don't know well guys that's going to do it for me tonight i hope y'all had a wonderful time we'll be back tomorrow with nerd cave news y'all have a fantastic night and I will see you at 7 p.m. Central Time for all the video game news that you need to know. Love you. Bye.